Electra, I'm sorry, but we cannot go out together now. Why? I received one SMS from the director. I must be in the bank in 10 minutes. Mm -hmm. Like always, no time. And we have some plans, you must break it. Thanks. I know, but it's my job and it's not my fault. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So, why do you don't go out with your girlfriends? Huh? Girlfriend? Why not? Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. Have a nice time. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I can't believe it. <laughs> oh it was good. <laughs> yeah. But Electra, anyway, we know each other now more than one year. Mm -hmm. And you don't tell me about your new boyfriend? He's a really nice guy, works in a bank. But he has never time for me. Then he comes home, he stays for a while, and then he runs away back to the office or for some meeting. We almost never had sex. No? But don't worry. Between us, nothing changed. We will always stay in my best lover until like the first man. That's so sweet. But you know, Nicole came here with three other girls to get this job on the resort. Mm -hmm. And I promised her to help her to get this job. Because she is sweet. Nice and friendly. Yeah. And I like her very much. So I would like to have her. Mm -hmm. What do you think? Do you kiss each other? Huh? Come on. Come on. Mm -hmm. Hello Mr. Valentini, it's me Oscar. I have the 41,000 euros. So, if for you is okay, we can meet uh, now? <laughs> okay, okay, it's better later. Uh, what do you think? Uh, in the bar of the bridge club is okay for you? Son of a bitch. 1,700 euros for a ring which is worth less than 50 euros. Fuck! Shit! I was so stupid. This fucking asshole. He needs a lesson. Where is he? Yeah, he's inside the bar. I think he sold my car. <laughs> yeah, and the ring he sold me is less than 50 euros. <laughs> Fucking bastard. I wanna beat him. Well, let's go inside, come on. Good. So we can also talk about uh, the other business with your friend. Good, really good. Okay, so uh, see you this evening. Goodbye. You motherfucker, 1,700 euros for a shit ring, huh? Where is my car? Hey, wait, I can't... You said my car! I can't explain! Bring you everything! Hi, Oscar. Oh, Mr. Valentini. But, what happened? Uh, nothing. It's, it's a long story. Oh. Uh, may I have a juice, please? Of course. But, uh, where is your friend? He's a very discreet person. He cannot be seen around here. You understand? He's waiting at the Hotel Imperio where I book a room on my name. So you know what we will do. I will take the money to Mr. Fanfan. So I show him that he really gets a very good investment. I will take the 500,000 euro cash and I'll bring that to you. Good. Do you have the rest of the money for Fanfan? Yes. 41,000 euros. Great. Well, I'll be back in a while. Mm -hmm. Keep my drink. But I need a receipt this time. No problem. See you later. See you later. believe it. 94,000 euros from this check and another 500,000 from the friend of Mr. Valentini. Not bad, really not bad. 
accept uh, this little inconvenience. I think I will be a rich man, but it's starting to be dangerous. It's time to leave the island. Hello, good morning. I'd like to to book a seat for tomorrow morning to Paris, first class. Mm -hmm. In my name, Mr. Francesco Tonelli. Yeah. 11.30 is perfect, okay. Number 427, okay, okay, thank you. Good, really good. <laughs> that fucking bastard. He wanted to fuck us. You imagine? He wanted to steal our money. Oh. <laughs> well, this time he found two swindlers smarter than him. <laughs> <laughs> he thought really that you were my daughter. And that bitch that we found in a bordel in Ukraine, oh. she was Fiera's wife. <laughs> but guys, get quiet. You know what we do now? We take the boat, we move to Martinique. Mm -hmm. So tomorrow, when he will come to the bank and he will find out that the check is fake, what he does? He come here and we find nobody! <laughs> <laughs> so cheers for us! <laughs> Fuck me. I cannot believe it. They don't have any room here. <sighs> Fucking bastards. <sighs> they robbed me 50,000 euros. <sighs>